Welcome to Headline News 24/7. Please click like and subscribe. Liberals furious at what Melania was just caught doing at border on sudden unexpected trip. The last 24 hours have been exceptionally stressful for Melania Trump. Her young son had become the target of Hollywood's rage once again, this time over the overinflated immigration issue that leftists have created fake outrage for as a means of deflecting from the real controversy exposed in the recently released IG report. However, the threat to Baron Trump went beyond repulsive insults and name calling, as has been the case in the past. This time, washed up actor Peter Fonda, who is the brother of liberal activist and actress Jane Fonda, posted to Twitter on Wednesday that the young first son should be separated from his mother and put in a cage with pedophiles. This was to say that Barron deserves the same horror that Fonda and other liberals' alleged illegal children are suffering right now. The extreme abuse the left and Hollywood elitists are claiming is happening to these children is not accurate, yet they push it still as their latest tactic to drill Donald Trump. While many out-of-touch celebrities are complaining about kids on the border which they know nothing about, our first lady has cleared her schedule to go see for herself. Unlike liberals in Hollywood, Melania is not going to form an opinion of push something publicly that she doesn't understand firsthand. Even more important to her is that she makes a difference in the lives of children who need love, attention, and support. This has been a constant theme with her as she's always making the rounds at children's hospitals wherever she goes. Going to the border in Texas to address the concerns was her latest, and perhaps most important, outreach. The left who has created a lot of seemingly fake hate for Trump over this crisis is not happy about what cameras caught when Melania Trump showed up. According to the Patriot Journal As the fake news media stirs up empty controversy, it looks like Melania is seeking answers. Over the weekend, we were inundated with overblown reports about illegal immigrant children. The mainstream media has suddenly grown a conscience, worried about the fate of children of criminal aliens. Funny how they never care about American kids. The First Lady took a trip to see firsthand what is going on at the border. As usual, what the press reported is nothing like the reality. From CNN First Lady Melania Trump touched down in McAllen, Texas, Thursday making a publicly unannounced and hastily planned trip to get a first-hand look at the crisis affecting immigrant families at the U.S. border. I want to thank you for your hard work, your compassion and your kindness, the First Lady said at a roundtable briefing at Upbring New Hope, with doctors and medical staff social workers and other experts on hand. She wants to see what's real, said the First Lady's spokeswoman Stephanie Grisham told CNN during a 10-minute press briefing en route to Texas. She wanted to see as close to what she had been seeing on TV. She wants to see a realistic view of what's happening. Trump's first stop in Texas is the Upbring New Hope Children's Center, part of Lutheran Social Services of the South, also in McAllen. Texas, a Department of Health and Human Services overseen facility housing 60 children, ranging in age from 5 to 17 years old. According to an administration official, of those 60, about six are children who have been recently separated from their parents. Melania is seeing the reality of what's really happening with children at the border, rather than a narrative created to distract and divide America. While the left is pushing the idea that all abandoned children and the result of their parents being arrested for illegal immigration, the truth is that only one-tenth of these kids are being held there under these circumstances. What's actually far worse and more concerning is that the rest of the 60 children mentioned in the report are smuggled in by coyotes, paid professionals, Patriot Journal reports. You see, that is more common than parents bringing children with them. Smugglers kidnap or take kids from families to use as anchors, given Obama's terrible DACA policy, Patriot Journal added. While lost children is a heartbreaking reality, the real cause of how this has become a problem at the border is exceptionally important to know, and it's not for the crisis that the left has created. Border Patrol agent and National Border Patrol Council spokesman Chris Cabrera laid it out for all the liberals of what it's really like, including the CNN host who had him on her show expecting that he would support her leftist narrative about kids being separated from their parents because of Trump. I don't think everybody understands what's happening down here. You know, a lot of these kids that are coming here, and put through terrible, terrible situations by their parents, they are brought over in extremely dangerous conditions, in extremely dangerous terrain, and all this can be avoided if they just go through the port of entry. There would be no crime committed by them and they wouldn't get separated. Why they don't do this is beyond me, explained Cabrera, according to the Daily Wire, adding, as we all know, when you get arrested, you don't get to stay with your family. That was the news. We thought you might be interested in knowing about this. Please click like and subscribe. Thank you.